Hello everyone and today this is Luca AFC here and we are back with the match day vlog, the match day experience as MK Dons home to Accrington Stanley. Accrington Stanley in the last five games of course have won two, lost two and drawn one. So not on the greatest form. John Coleman is the manager. The last time we met was of course Mike Winston's first game in charge. I wasn't at, at, at Aki um, at the start of the season, but we lost 1-0 at Accrington Stanley in the middle of the season. Um, they're currently sitting in about 11th place, six points behind us, and while we're sitting in sixth place, the MK Dons logs are back, of course, and um, I'm really looking forward to this game outside State of MK with a different location. And the match day vlogs are back now. Of course, we are going to be going to Bradford on Tuesday. Um, I couldn't make it to Barrow last week. And um, I do, do want to give a massive shout out. Uh, and I will be joining them at the end of the season. Um, it's the MK fellas. Please, please go and have a look at their YouTube channel. Bit. If you haven't seen their announcement, go on their page on Facebook. You'll be able to actually see the MK fellas or Twitter page. Give them a massive, massive shout out. They've got bigger, massive content coming up on the channel. And uh, please make sure you do subscribe to their channel. But score prediction for tomorrow. I'm going to go for a 2 1 MK Dons. I do think we will get the victory, mate. So we're at MK Dons right now. Um, of course, we've arrived at Stadium of MK um, for our Sky Bet League 2 clash. Um, against uh, Atkinson Stanley. The lineup is out. It's Marshall, Dean Lewington, Williams, Gilby, Kane, Thompson, Robson, Harvey, Kemp, Lofthouse, Bate. On the bench, Kelly, Cameron Norman, Harrison is back in the team. Uh, Tesco, our new striker, which I'm going to see because I wasn't at the Barrow last week. When Dennis and Tripp. For me, it's more like a false number nine. It's more like Dan Kemp is up front. Um, yes, there was rumours yesterday, but I believe it was so fake that MK Dons were looking at um, the former Coventry striker Mark Minolte. But it looks like it's a bit of a false, a false number nine team with Dan Kemp up front. It's going to be an interesting how we play. I hope it's more better. I hope it's more better style than compared to the last home game. But we, it's an opportunity today now because we need to bounce back. A win today puts us in fifth place. And we've got to rely on results now because we've got Bradford on Tuesday, then we've got Swindon next week, then we've got Wrexham. Games are coming thick and fast, three games within a week. But confident today, I expect us a 2 1 win, man. <laughs> First five minutes gone, a bit of a poor start. Um, is it going to be one of those games where we've actually changed the formation last minute with Dan Kemp and Gilby up top? Because personally, I thought it was going to be a false number nine. Is it going to be one of those games where we're going to struggle to score? Let's see. Yeah. I'll tell you what, right, a bit of a deflection going in from that, but what was the defending doing from there? Like, literally, it came off Williams' own goal, and Atkinson take the lead, and it's 1-0. And I personally thought it came off Dean Lewington, but, but for me, the, I've seen the quiet atmosphere in the cow shed, but with 1-0 down at the moment, a bit of a poor start. So Aki take the lead 1-0 Atkinson in, it came off an own goal and I think it was from MG Williams um, but for me a bit of a poor start no, 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 no. Like, literally the defence is like literally all over the place, it's like we're running out of ideas and look I can understand yes the formation yes we're very short up front with strikers and 
with Gilby and Kemp playing up front, it is early days. It's only about 12 minutes gone in the game, but we seem to be struggling. Like, there's no central forward. And when you miss a quality like a Max Dean, that obviously gives that work rate. When Max Dean's in the team, we play better. So, still 1 0. So, it's a free kick to Appleton Stanley at the moment. I swear to God that, that our players Two don't nil. really, really want to be up for it for today. Like, every single time Two I nil. see the midfield, I literally see like the likes of Lewis Bate, Ethan Watson. I swear every single time they kick the ball, they don't even want it today. They don't like There's nothing there. The atmosphere is dead. There's, it's all flat. We're struggling up front. The, you know what I mean? We don't really want it today. Something's got to really change up in the second half. Come on, come on. I'll tell you what, right? I've just counted. There's about 65, 70 Atkins and Stanley's fans watching there. With no atmosphere. At a Premiership Stadium, which doesn't get filled out for a Sky Bet League 2. And then literally, the atmosphere's so dead. Come on! Come on, boy! Come on! Come on. Come on, come on, and I'll tell you what, 
the last 20 minutes we've woken up. 70 minutes, the atmosphere was dead, but the last 20 minutes, it's been a fortress. Could be free here, it could be free! Oh, what a chance. I got on the fifth here now, man. I'll tell you what, right? What a game, full time, MK Dons 2, Atkinson 1, I called it, this is right every single time, I always say 2-1, two, 2-1, one, two, one. it's my favourite scoreline prediction my friend, but what, I tell you what, first 70 minutes we were diabolical, the atmosphere was dead, but the last 20 minutes, I want to big up to Alfie and them lot over there for doing the drumming, Big up to that, and I'll tell you what, the last 20 minutes, we fucking needed that. After the first 70 minutes was poor, what a fucking win today. And with games coming up like Bradford, Wrexham, Swindon, these are the kind of games you want to win, like the Atkinsons and that, to get out of this league, to get back where we want to be. Is playing Sky Bet League One football. It's where this football club, this stadium needs to be. But we are going to end the video from here. Can we have at least 70 likes on the video? Much appreciated. And I'll see you on Tuesday at Bradford. Looking forward to it. New ground setting.